Hello everybody, this is Lord CT, and this is episode 6 of The Adventures of Catface. Where we left off, we just stole a, uh... Ooh, it's raining. No, I guess not. Uh, we just stole the information, or the tax report that, uh... Aronimus Lex, uh, collected taxes from the waterfront. And, one little side note, if you haven't noticed already, I have downloaded a few mods. And one of them completely changes how the armor Hi. looks on the uh, Imperial Guards, among 500 billion other things. And yeah, uh, what if I notice nothing. if I notice uh, any of the changes right away, I will be sure to inform you. But for the most part, these are all uh, text-related and mesh-related, meaning it's just the appearance of all the stuff rather than uh, adding new content to the game. But, uh, if you recall, I mentioned that I would be adding a, uh, a mod that fixed the prices of miscellaneous objects, and now clay plates are worth 10 gold, and pewter knives are worth 3 instead of 0. So now everything I steal is going to be worth a lot more, and in a sense you could call it cheating, because it makes things a lot easier to uh, sell to get gold, but I, I kind of counterbalance that with a mod called... Uh, an Oscaro's Oblivion Overhaul. I think that's how it's pronounced. And basically, it's supposed to make the game completely different, where uh, typically every single mob is going to level up with you, and every mob is going to be the same challenge rating. But with this, every mob and everything is set levels throughout the entire game, so I'll be, I may be running into level 20 stuff at level 1 or 2, so that'd be a little exciting. Have you recovered those taxes? Yes. Ah, the Grey Fox will be very pleased. We will make sure this gets back to the people. Can you believe that fool even bothered to collect this paltry sum? You can keep it. I merely wanted the watch to know they went too far. I think it's time to promote you to Footpad. Congratulations on your new guild rank. Excellent. So you can I do any more? I do have need of a skilled operative. Perhaps, if you were to get more experience, I could use you. The fences report to me how much loot you have turned over to them. When you've added more to the guild coffers, come back and see me. Alright then. Well... Shadow hides you. Shadow hides you too. So, I'm going to need to steal some more stuff. And I think the best place I can go to steal some more stuff would be... Maybe the market district? Yeah, that sounds like a good idea. Steal some stuff from the market. Okay, so instead of just running there, I might as well just, uh. Well, maybe not the market. How about. Hmm. Let's go to the plaza. There's some rich people there. Oh, one thing I just noticed. The Imperial Honestly. Guards have capes What now. is it, citizen? They have... They have... They have capes. Isn't that adorable? I think that's precious. But, uh, let's see. Typically, these four houses are gonna be the most, uh, wealthy. One. Oh, not this again. Okay. <sighs> one, two. One, two. Yes. I really need to practice that on the side because that's a little ridiculous. It sounds like somebody's moving around. I, apparently one of my mods added a bunch of new items, too. I think that's what that noise is, a bunch of items clanking into each other. Cheese, apple... Fine wood desk. Okay. Let's see if I can do it. How about I just do the auto attempt? No. 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 
There we go. Ooh, 100 gold. Might as well take nah, let's leave that. Yes, steal all the food. Stealing is much more exciting because things are worth a lot more. Oh, he has every he has a lot of expensive books. Who this person is. All the books. Ones of alchemy. Makes standard tactics. Yeah. Silverbowl. How much weight am I carrying? Alright, so I'm starting to run out of room in my inventory, but I can steal a few more things. Okay. I'm gonna quick save it right here just in case I use up all of my lockpicks. Oh. It's beyond my abilities. Never mind then. Let's see. What? The barrel just opened. What? That's cool. That's a nice touch. I like that. But okay. Um. Is this open? Oh, it just falls to the ground. Ooh. Yeah. Oh! Yarn. I will keep that for myself. Because, you know, I'm a Khajiit. And I like yarn. Don't judge me. Okay, so apparently there's white hands all over that. I think that just symbolizes if I've opened it or not. Okay, what is that noise? That's starting to get really annoying. And I'm a really crummy thief if I'm leaving my handprints all over the place. Okay, how much print do I have? Okay, I have a little bit more. I'm gonna see how difficult it'll be to break into here. Oh, no, not at all. Okay. Ooh, there he is. Gonna be very, very sneaky. Very sneaky. Ooh. None of that. Nope. Oh, I thought those were two swords. Take your book and your urn. I'm sleeping like a baby. Oh, another mod that I got was a. Uh, okay, another mod that I got was uh, no more psychic guards, and that basically makes it so uh, if I commit a crime, not every single guard in the entire world is gonna know I immediately committed that. So that's it's really helpful because that was one of the. Uh, Wait a second. Wait. Whosoever answers your whisper hides in raptured, recorded, and saved. Oh. I thought that was like one of those books. Alright, so I'm a little encumbered, so let's... Which one? Mythic Dawn Commentaries. This dude is part of the Mythic Dawn. Whoever answers... No, I already read that. If I recall correctly, that's what you're supposed to do. Greetings, reader. Enter every night. Oh, wait. Greetings, reader. Enter as Lord Dagon has written. Every quarter has known us. Night follows day. Enter as Lord Dagon has written. My own summons come through. Book Lord. Blah, 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 blah. blah. Alright, I don't know what I'm doing. Uh, there's nothing worth stealing up here, so that's interesting. I wonder if I should put these back in case... Nah, I'm not gonna do the main quest. Screw that. Okay, so meat is not worth a lot, and cheese
cheap wine is not worth a lot. What else is taking up a lot of space? Let's see. You can drop one of these books, I guess. I need to drop two of them. Or, let's see, there's probably an item that has a lot of weight. But that, that's worth a lot. Oh yeah, I'll just drop some books. 45, 40, 40, 40, 40, 25, 20, 10, 20, 20, and... There. Alright, he's gonna be really confused when he comes upstairs and finds all the stuff missing. But I don't care, haha. <laughs> Okay. Wait. That is a weird place to put a cupboard. Whoa! I bumped into his head. Ah. Really? I'm encumbered again? Alright. Take that. Wait. Better idea. I am smart. Haha. <laughs> Because potions weigh less than you know, chemical ingredients. And this will get my alchemy skill up as well, so. Two birds with stone. interesting. And now I clean up the hands. Huh. Aha. I'm starting to figure this mod out. Is he awake? Please tell me he's not awake. Okay, no he's not. I'm making a huge profit off of just one dude. Yarn! <coughs> mm. oh. I wonder if leaving my handprints will actually make it so people can find me. It'd be interesting. I hope not, anyway. Suppose we shall find out. They didn't have any, uh, like any of the, uh, what's it called? Oh, what am I thinking of? I'm trying to think of the word for, uh, oh, I keep hearing that noise and it freaks me out. I keep thinking somebody's coming downstairs. Uh, what is that called? Where they take fingerprints and do fingerprint analysis, something like that. They didn't have that back then. So, I should be safe. I mean, I'm not the only Khajiit in the Imperial City, right? Yeah. I've got nothing to worry about. Alright, so, I'm going to... How come you don't get Hello a cake? Oh. Let's see, it's daytime, so he's at his house. I think. Should be right. There's another mod that I was looking at that uh, makes everything super realistic, whereas, uh, by, by that I mean, uh, if I sell stuff to a merchant, he will start losing money, and he won't be able to buy any more of my stuff, because he's out of money, but, uh, I didn't really want to do that because I didn't want to have to hassle with that. 
I'm really tired. Can we get on with this? Yes. You got some hot property. Okay. And now for the really fun part. A good Items. That's you. You got. I think I can. I think I can. A good. A. You got. You got. That's a. That's a good deal. That seems you that you Okay. Now what can I buy from you that's worth buying? Do you have any lockpicks? Yes, you do. I will buy every single one of your I shouldn't lock picks. sell it to you so cheap, but I know you. I, I shouldn't sell yarn. it to you so cheap, but I know you won't ask. To I. Sh You're. I. You. I should. I shouldn't. I shouldn't sell it to you so cheap. You but I know you won't ask too many questions. Uh, how many arrows do I have? I've got plenty. Yeah, I'm set. Huh? Okay, goodbye. Shadow hide you. Shadow hide you too? Well, I fenced way over 500. Alright, so I'm going to make potions later, because that's not interesting. And now to the waterfront, pick up a quest, and then pause it. I think this this is a good video so far. I made quite a bit of gold. I stole quite a bit of stuff. I discovered a uh, Mythic Dawn cultist. All in all, pretty good. Pretty good night. Raining. Good to see you again. Good to see you too. The guild has received a request to obtain a unique statuette. It is a bust of Lafasa Indaris, the recently slain Countess of Chainhall. You will be paid a modest sum. Do you want this job? Wait. Am I the only one who notices this? Look at this eye. This one. This one is higher than that one. But yes, I'll take it. Excellent. Bring it back to me once you have it. Okay. Shall and I I'm going to pause it. Thank you for watching, and I hope you enjoyed it just as much as I have. It's been a pleasure, and hope to see you again.